Hi there, I'm Nat Alton and I'm the CEO of the YMCA of Catawba Valley and I'm so excited you clicked that video link because we've missed having you inside the YMCA and we are really excited to reopen and have you come back to your YMCA where you belong. We are going to look and operate differently and we're going to ask you to join us in keeping our YMCA as safe as possible. So before you come to the Y, make sure you feel at your very best because it's important that we are working to protect the health of our neighbors. In times of crisis, it's important to focus on your values. The Y's values are simple, caring, honesty, respect, responsibility, and faith. And so we are calling ourselves to do more, to be more and we're calling on you to do more as well. We care about the widening achievement gap during this time of school closure, which is why we have been helping children attend virtual homeschooling sessions and sending home activities. We care about seniors and members of our chronic disease program who face real consequences and possible loss of mobility or mental wellness changes, which is why we've been doing wellness checks on our seniors and vulnerable populations within our membership. And we care about you. We care about your safety, which is why we are taking extraordinary efforts to redesign the whole facility by creating wide open spaces between the equipment so that you can exercise in relative safety. Creating that space for your safety means that we've had to repurpose some of your favorite spaces. It also means that we've had to put away some of our favorite pieces of equipment to create that space. When you come to the YMCA, we will encourage you to bring your own personal equipment. For example, if you're taking a yoga class, please bring your own yoga mat. We also ask that you clean and wipe down all the equipment before and after you use it. It also means that some of your favorite group exercise classes, for now at least, will have to take place outside or in the gymnasium. We have been cleaning and we're going to do more cleaning than ever before. And when you come to the YMCA, your staff are going to be smiling, but they're going to be wearing a mask. More is going to be asked of you because if we are really going to fight this disease, we need your help. We're going to ask you to be diligent in wiping equipment before and after use, adhere to social distancing, and follow suggested guidelines. We know these measures may not prevent you from getting sick or spreading the disease to others, but if we can stay six feet apart and do our due diligence, we can really help make a difference in slowing this disease. That's why at the Y, you'll find things like directional signage for which way to go up or down stairs, as well as enter and exit the building. The locker rooms will only be open for restroom access. You'll need to come ready to work out, and you'll need to give people the space they need to feel safe while they exercise. I want to take a minute to thank all of our donors and members who have stayed with us. By continuing to be part of our YMCA, you have helped us deploy and expand resources and services to our community. For example, we have been providing emergency child care to essential personnel. We have had over 100 kids present every day, and that makes us one of the largest providers in the county. We have served as a void with one blood to ensure that blood pantries have remained stocked. We've had five drives and all of them have been full to capacity. Offering online workouts and live streaming YMCA classes to ensure that we stay healthy and connected during this time of isolation. We have been rewarding members who are staying active by providing t-shirts. We're providing educational resources to parents and children as they adjust to the new normal. We've provided care bags to members that include crayons, candy, activity sheets, and healthy recipes. We've hosted trivia night for families to compete with each other inside of their own homes. We have continued to develop new content for our virtual YMCA website, and we look forward to this expanding in the days and months to come. And there's so much more that we've done that you've been able to help us provide, and we say thank you. Uh, YMCAs are all about connecting people bringing people together. COVID-19 has been hard on all of us, but if we are creative and if we have an open heart and we work hard, we can keep our community safe. We can care for our children and we can enjoy our YMCA. We are so excited to have you back and we can't wait to see you.